Hey guys, Dark Blade is back with another episode of reaction. So real quick, I just want to say that Bale vs. Quashrite decided to unleash, er, like, make, release a bunch of episodes at the same time. The show is over, it is finished. I've watched them all and it is really good, it is really epic. I don't want to spoil, but I'm still going to react to each episode one at a time. So right now I'm I'm going to react to episode 17. I just rewatch it so I don't get don't get mixed up with what happened in which episode. So let's get right into it. So from episode 16 we got a phone call from Shu. And sorry about all the peeping. I have chicks on my arm right now. But anyway, so in episode 16 we get a phone call from Shu and he says something epic's going on. So Vol, in this episode, of course, he wants to go over there to England where the original Masquerade Tournament was held. If you guys didn't know that, there's your fact. I didn't know that. And Pax is going there too, for some reason. He wants to see what it's all about. So, then, at England, Vault meets up with the scientists in Shu. One of the scientists, I think, is Fumia's dad. That's just a personal theory. But anyway, so Volt meets up with Shu, and they see this really cool new stadium called the Ether Stadium. So what it does is we've been, we've been hearing a lot about elemental power, but what is that? Well, the Ether Stadium shows it. It's not like just like a thing you can get on graphs. You can actually see it now because of the stadium. So that's really cool. Pax is even intrigued. He actually he actually shows a lot of emotion, well, kind of, for his standards, for seeing the stadium. So to test out the elemental power, oh yeah, Pax shows up there too, and he's like, "You you scientists have no idea what you're talking about." I know more than anyone about elementals. You know, he's like that. But yeah, then Volt and Chu are going to battle, and Pax watches. You know, he really impresses the other scientists by all his knowledge about the elements. But, so Volt and Chu do this pretty intense battle. I mean, it wasn't that good of a battle. It was first the one point. It was, like, really crazy. We saw, like, the bays were glowing. You know, because their elementals were showing. But they're, they're on Pax's chart. Their elemental power was not that strong. It was like half. So yeah, they battle. Like a bunch of explosions happen. We can't see what happens. But Pax saw. And the score was... Oh yeah, Shu has a new Spryzen. It's called Bolt Spryzen. I forgot to bring that up. He has a new Hasbro Spryzen. So that's kind of cool. So yeah, then they both explode. Blah, blah, blah. Pax sees the score. And it was... Shu got a ring out finish on Volt. And then a pretty epic part happens where, so yeah, Shu got a ring out, but it was so close. They both got rung out, but Shu, Volt, Faltrick hit the floor first. So, after that, so yeah, there's a part, the kind of funny part where Volt's like, I had more elemental power than you, and Shu's like, no, I did. It's just funny, because Shu, Shu's like joking around like that, it's kind of funny. But yeah, Pax, then Pax kind of gets mad, he's like, none of you do, I'm the only one who can. Oh yeah, I forgot to mention earlier in this episode, Pre and Pax got on a little bit of a fight. He said Pre was useless if she can't win. But yeah, then after Pax is mad at Volt and Shu, he says like, "You don't know what you're talking about. Only my Pandora can win." And Pre like is like triggered because he said his Pandora when it's both of theirs. He meant to say our Pandora. And yeah, the episode. So yeah, after that battle. Whatever. Sorry, the chicks got kind of escaped. So after that battle, pretty much nothing really happens after Pax says that. Pri is upset. She talks to Iger a little bit about it. Not really. We get to see some funny Bell and Ranzo moments. But yeah, that's pretty much it. It was pretty cool to see Volt and Shu battle again. I wish we got a full battle, though. But let me tell you guys, the episodes get really epic in a second. Like, in, like, two more episodes. I think episode 20 is where it gets really good. So stay tuned for that. Love the episode. It was awesome. Love to see Shu back. It was actually cooler than I expected it to be. And the Ether Stadium is just really, really hype. I actually, this is actually a stadium I'm kind of hyped for. But anyway, thank you guys for watching. See you guys later. Dark Blade is out of here.